the SIM card tray that is traditionally found on all the iPhones before the iPhone 14 series is about to become a thing of the past. This physical SIM card tray is going to be converted into electronic SIM that is going to be inside your phone's software. So every iPhone that came before the iPhone 14 has a physical SIM card tray and you can see it right there. And as you know, you have to poke that little hole with a SIM card ejection tool to bring out the SIM card tray. And this is what comes out. Now with the iPhone 14 and onwards, this SIM card tray is not going to exist anymore. This is going to be converted to electronic SIM. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to convert your existing physical SIM card to an eSIM on any iPhone that supports it. All right, so here we have an iPhone 13 Pro Max. We are using this as an example, but you can do this basically on any iPhone. So the first step is to go to the settings. And then what you wanna do is you wanna tap on the cellular option. And of course the phone does have to have a physical SIM that's active. And what you are gonna see is over here, you're gonna see your carrier. And at the bottom, you're gonna see the convert to eSIM option. If you don't see this option, your carrier does not support conversion to an eSIM. You probably have to call them directly to see how it is done. Now in my case, this is an AT&T phone and they do support convert to eSIM option and that's why this option is visible. So the next step is simply to tap on it, okay? And it's gonna show you convert to eSIM. It says this phone number is on a physical SIM you can convert it to an eSIM. And then it's gonna say AT&T SIM or whatever your carrier is. At the bottom, it's gonna show you the number that we're dealing with. In my case, I just have it blurred out. But you're gonna see your number right there. That's gonna go from the physical to the E. And then at the bottom, it's gonna say convert cellular plan. When you click on the convert cellular plan, you're gonna get this pop-up that says convert to eSIM. It says once it is converted, you can remove the SIM card tray. So let me just tap on convert to eSIM right now. All right, so what's gonna happen is at the bottom, it is gonna say activating. So that might take a couple minutes based on the carrier or whatever. So let's wait for this to complete and see what kind of message we do get. So it looks like it jumped up to this screen right here. It is still saying activating on the primary number. This might look a little bit different in your case, but it's mostly going to be exactly the same. You're going to see that you're going to see that activating text right there and looks like we're done. Okay? So primary number is right here. It is in fact activating. It is on right now. On the top, I can see the bar is back, so I can now make calls. It might take a couple seconds. Now, one thing that you want to do to finish this off is you want to remove your physical SIM card and restart the phone. I'm going to do that right now. All right, so I removed the uh, SIM from the SIM card tray. I'm going to put this back in here. All right. And then all you want to do is you just want to restart the phone. So I'm going to press and hold, slide to power off. Okay, it is turning back on. All right, so let's go back into the settings. All right, I'm going to go back into cellular. And now I can see that I have AT&T line activated. There is an eSIM here because now I have the option to say delete eSIM as you can see. So that's the conversion process from a physical uh, SIM, which is this guy right here, to an electronic SIM. Now you don't need this anymore. And you can still use, if you still have a SIM card, you can use this for another number if your carrier supports it, or you can add additional eSIMs right from here if you need multiple numbers. Again, if your carrier supports it, all right? So just because you don't have a physical SIM doesn't mean you cannot have multiple numbers. You can still add additional lines and numbers to this phone right from here through your carrier.